Number one, Khalil Shakir out of Boise State. He was the best skill position to me at the senior bowl throughout the week. He didn't play in the game, obviously, but route running, he wasn't the fastest wide receiver at the senior bowl but he showed some serious route running skills. Whether it was the one-on-ones with the DBs, that goal line practice, uh, well, it was really a red zone practice uh, on day three indoors, he killed it. The quarterbacks couldn't stop throwing him the ball. He was getting more open than any other wide receiver there. And he was getting open with ease, to be honest. Now moving to the numbers and moving to the tape in terms of you know his actual college production, uh, he looked really good. Now, he has tape that showed that he's capable on both the outside and in the slot. His sophomore and his senior year, he was running primarily out of the slot and he put up some really good numbers his senior year especially, uh, but he actually played on the outside primarily during his junior year and that was in 2020. Uh, COVID year, they were limited to only seven games, but he was on pace for a monster year. It would have been his best year in his college career. And that was when he was lining up on the outside. So the fact that he does have some tape on that is awesome. And I was able to sit down with Khalil Shakir uh, and talk about that. And he is satisfied with what he has shown on the outside and what's on tape. You know, during the interview, he did mention that he is running more outside here. The coaches are making sure that he does run outside during the senior bowl practices and run those perimeter type of routes. So not only is Shakir versatile in terms of playing on the outside versus playing in the slot, he's also versatile in terms of taking handoffs out of the backfield, whether that's sweeps, whether that's, you know, up the middle, right? Um, so he's somebody that, you know, could potentially, you know, have a handful of carries in the NFL as well. And I did talk to him about that. He said that, you know, he's willing to do whatever. Now, as far as his college production, uh, he had a 40.8% dominator rating. Basically what this dominator rating means uh, is the percentage of uh, the total team's output, how much of that total production um, was accounted by by that player. So in Khalil Shakir's case, he basically accounted for 40.8% of the total production while he was there at Boise State, which is pretty significant. He had a breakout age of 19 years old, uh, which is good by the way. And what, what does that mean? What does a breakout age mean? How do you know when a wide receiver has broken out? We'll basically look at that breakout age as when did they eclipse that 20% dominator rating? When were they responsible for 20% of their team's output. That's in terms of, you know, yardage and touchdowns, right? Now, it is worth noting that he only, you know, went up against press coverage 59 times uh, in his senior year. So there, there might be some questions there, but there is no doubt that he can be a very productive receiver at the next level. So, you know, you combine the breakout age with the overall dominator rating on paper, you're looking at someone who's pretty impressive. Combine that with what he showed us at the senior bowl and, and what he put on tape. And, you know, it's looking like, he definitely improved his stock. We'll see where he lands in the NFL. We'll see what round, but it could be anywhere from the late first to maybe third round. But thank you guys so much for watching my Senior Bowl review. If you haven't liked the video already, please do so. It'll help me a lot. Also, if you haven't subscribed to the channel, uh, I'm gonna be doing a lot more of this moving forward. See ya.